that. We can do any. Everything is why the minute. I just parked. Reverse parked. He's like, why are you going back with mummy? Why? I said, because I'm back. And he's like, but why? 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 Good morning. We are at the, well, it's nearly midday. We are at the playground. Shock. You all right? Yeah, that's an electric shock. Are you okay? Yeah, oh, poor Baba. Hey, go. Okay, we're finished in the playground now. Did everyone have a good time? Me! Yeah, no one's a bit tearful. We are trying to cut down on the D-U-M-M-Y um, at the minute. So, there's a few meltdowns. But Eddie, you had a good time? No one had a good time too. She's just uh, cracking up now that she's in the car. Yeah. Yeah. So we've got to go to Aldi and let me tell you what happened this week in Aldi. Um, Eddie, not always, but he still gets ID'd quite frequently, like maybe every three or four months. Um, he is two years older than me and I haven't been ID'd in years. You can see like, I've got lots of grey gray hairs. That's another story. Um, but this week I went to get a bottle of wine yeah. from Aldi and we had just been talking about it the day before um, how he had got ID'd recently and I was like I haven't been ID'd in years like years I'd say since before I had the kids um, and <laughs> I took the bottle of wine anyway and I got ID'd and I was like I'm 30 years old I think and I didn't have I happened to not have my driving license with me and she's like, well, I can't serve you then. I was like, well, me? <laughs> me? Although I was flattered, I was a bit annoyed. What, darling? My cousin, cross game. She's cross game. Why? You. <gasps> you. What? You. You. <laughs> you. 
cheeky little monkey. Excuse me? Yeah. You. you! 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 I don't know why we're all shouting. Yeah. You. And another fun fact is, I am yeah. so grey. I'm going to the hairdressers yeah, next yeah. week. Um, yeah. I haven't been to the hairdressers yeah. since before Noni was yeah. born. I've been colouring my own hair. And the last time I coloured it, I, I went a bit too dark. I accidentally just got like a shade darker than I yeah. used to. Um, I want to go and get it lightened up and like my greys are just gone is it? out of control so um, I've always had a few greys and I always had a few like a, a patch at the like a gathering at the front of grey hairs but when Noni was three months old she was in the hospital she got really sick and like overnight that like little cluster of grey hairs I'd say there was about eight or nine of them turned into a full-on streak like a shock of white hair um, and also then speckled all the way through my hair like overnight like I just went way grayer um, yes no no we're not allowed we're gonna go in the trolley um, Shouting, please. So yeah, but I'm terrified of going to the hairdresser. I've just had so many bad experiences. I think because I never found a good hairdresser in Perth. Um, at one stage, one of my friends, she's a hairdresser. She was living there for a while, and um, she was doing my hair, and that was great. But every other time I went to someone, um, like before and after her being there, I just was never happy with the cut and you spend hundreds of dollars yeah. and then to not be happy with it um, and then we'll so and I've only we'll gone to a couple here since and I moved we'll here bump. and then I was like I just give up I'm growing my hair anyway so we'll but it does need tidied up so I'm just terrified like I feel like I'll cry if it goes wrong Yay. does anyone else have a fear of hairdressers and it's real we'll it's bump. a real fear we'll okay we're at Aldi now we finished up an Aldi and I'm just about to have my lunch. It's a bit of a weird concoction, but it's nice. Um, the, sorry, this is all work stuff. Um, the kids have gone to bed. They had their lunch and they went to bed. Um, I'm just gonna sit down, do a little bit of work and eat my lunch and then have a coffee because I'm tired. Oh, what happened here? Um, She's just up from her nap and she's not happy. <laughs> she's happy now because I've got her in the kitchen. Sometimes I think they're just like crying. She's crying because I'm not letting her in the So this is distraction. She's going to help me get dinner ready. <laughs> we do what? mixing and watermelon and carrots and mixing. What did you, what were you, what were you saying to you? Watermelon. Hey, what were you saying to you? Mixing. Watermelon. Mixing. Puddings. Puddings. Light and green. Hey, Eddie Oak, what were you saying <laughs> to you? You could stop watching. I should have smart day in the corner. Mm hmm. What did you find? A poop on the floor. Up there. I found it up there. Yeah. No. 
Now the car is sealed. Yeah, because it's stuck to your car. Shield, that's your poo poo. Poo poo in my car, too. Did you drive your car through the poo poo? Yeah. That's a bit silly, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Mummy should have cleaned up the garden, though, I suppose. Mm -hmm. Right, now we don't touch it, okay? Mummy's going to get something to clean it. All right? You rubbish? Uh. No, I'm not going to clean it with rubbish. The bin? Yeah, I'll, I'll, yeah, I'll sort it out. The bin? I'm not going to put it in the bin. The rubbish? Yeah. The bin? <laughs> the rubbish? The bin? The mm -hmm. rubbish? Yeah. Okay, the rubbish. Clean my car. Don't let cool drive. <laughs> See you in the next one. See you next one. Thumbs up. <laughs> Thanks for watching guys. Um, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And yeah, let me know in the comments, are you afraid of hairdressers or is it just me? <laughs> Bye!